What is up, guys? Today we're going to be reviewing the G.I. Joe Crimson Guard. So, this is the G.I. Joe Crimson Guard. Let me show you his box real quick. So, this is his box. Back. His number um, 50. He has a number 50. Crimson Guard. So this is him out of the box. There's the back of him. He looks pretty good, I do have to say. Definitely my favorite. One of my favorite characters. Definitely in my top definitely in my top five list not my top 10 top five he is probably my fourth favorite character um so this is him crimson guard is he his feet year is he 2021 so he about three years old So here you can see him. Good hip, good movement, and he has a knife holster right there and a pistol holster right there. So this is the character right here. His arms move pretty good. He can go up. And Move his head up and down a little bit. Side to side. 360 turn on the head. And his hands do a 360. So that is it for the character. Next is the accessories. Did I show the box? Yeah, I did, but here's the box just one more time. Alright, so this is a holder for a sword. Goes right here. And since I just showed you the sword holder, might as well grab his sword. The Crimson Guard is kind of a higher rank because he has a gun and a sword. So here's his sword. You can put his sword right in there. And next, let's do his pistol. So this is his pistol. Just basic. Front and the back. And the pistol just goes right there and the holster right there now next is this holster right here which is for this knife nice little knife you could just stick it in there so there he is and his final two accessories his backpack, nice little backpack. Oh, he actually, uh, he actually has two more accessories after this. All right, so there's his backpack. He has a little Cobra logo on there, super cool. And his second to last accessory, he has a gun his gun his little bayonet on there and the final accessory is the is the um, ammunition for the gun so you can just pop that right in there there should hear a little snap um you might be wondering what is this one for um I know this hole 
is, or the sword, but what is, um, this thing on the, the backpack? Um, so this actually is for the gun. If you take the, um, trigger section in the gun and plug it into there, it will go perfectly in. So, that is it for the Crimson Guard. But if you don't want his sword hanging onto his backpack, there's one more place you can put it. It's a little hole right here on his belt. It's above the pistol. Right here. You can plug the sword into there. And there you go. Doesn't fit very well with the pistol in there, so I prefer to usually just have it on the back. back. So, anyways, this is it for this G.I. Joe reaction video. Can't get him to stand up. So, this is it for this G.I. Joe reaction video. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Peace out and goodbye. And remember, G.I. Joe always rules.